Thursday night, a deadly fire engulfed a Bronx apartment complex. Among those killed were several children. People trapped, uh, apartment 13, we're getting a baby in there. Uh, also apartment 6, people trapped. Last I heard was my mom text my sister that they were trapped in the room. Fire officials said Friday morning that flames started in a first floor unit where a three-year-old boy was playing with burners on a stove. His mother noticed when the boy screamed. She exited her apartment with these, uh, her two-year-old and three-year-old and left the door open. So uh, this fire quickly spread up the stairs. Fire travels up, the stairway acted like a chimney. According to city records, there is at least one open violation reported in August of a defective carbon monoxide detector in a first floor apartment in this building. There's also an open violation indicating a defective smoke detector in the same apartment. It's unclear if that contributed to the tragedy. The owner of the building could not be reached for comment. This is an older building. I believe it's over 100 years old, uh, but it's still they're liable to make sure the basic safety elements are in place. But we should not speculate yet. It is uh, the time of year where people celebrate, and certainly here we have people who've lost their lives, lost their homes, lost their, uh, lost everything. And we, we grieve with them, uh, as everyone in this city should and does, uh, at this terrible time. I'm Natasha Chen reporting.